My next guest tonight is one of America's leading canine comedians, now reinventing himself as a political commentator. Dave, one question. Over here. Senator, is it true you tried to shut down the government so you could go to a Nickelback concert? Get him away. All right, I'm never gonna get to this guy, I can tell. I got a better idea. Welcome, Triumph, the insult comic dog. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank Triumph, you, Triumph, th thanks for being here. It's my pleasure. How's the show going? You, why, haven't you, haven't you been watching it? Oh, no, I'm sorry. I, I was stooping a Cairn Terrier backstage. <laughs> I always do it before I'm on. It's a pre-show tip I got from uh, Bill Maher. Little ritual I do. Well, congratulations on the new special. Thank you. It's on. It's on. <laughs> the new special on Hulu. Here, give it back. On Hulu, ladies and gentlemen. Hulu. Mm -hmm. Hulu. Now, all your favorite network shows with all your favorite commercials as well. Hulu. Now you've gotten great reviews. You've got, I have gotten amazing reviews. You've got fantastic reviews. Incredible reviews everywhere. Are you getting these good reviews just because the show is good, or are you bribing these guys? Wait a minute. After I get a good review, I sent one critic a nice photo from my personal stash of dog porn. These are actual photos that you this have was, sent I to critics this out to, who have said who nice things to, to you. This is someone from, uh, Some this blog. was someone at the... Decider. The, the, uh, the Newark Star Ledger. Oh, is this Seppenwall, Alan Seppenwall. He right. was very grateful. I do this to motivate other critics to write reviews, that's all. Here, 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 here's one a reward to a blogger. Yes, the Decider. It was an and, excellent and, review. And this one you actually said to Judd Apatow. This is my he retweeted, right said my show was hilarious. <laughs> You know, I want to encourage the showbiz community. Okay, so you're trying to be, you're trying to be like a, a, an honest to God journalist now. You're going exactly. out there and covering the, 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 the campaign as if you were a journalist. But, yes. but the, the, the jokes that you're doing are pretty lowbrow. You have to amount. Oh, to amount. really? Just think, millions of TVs are tuned into the show right now because the whole nation fell asleep during elementary. You've yes. gotten into covering the race a little bit later than other people. Are there any people who've already dropped out of the race who you miss? Yes, you know, when I covered it, I, I interacted with a lot of them in the special, but uh, since then, uh, Chris Christie's dropped out. I'm yeah, sorry yeah, about yeah, yeah. that. Uh, last week. You know, and I'm worried. I mean, now that he's not running for president, I'm worried that Chris Christie might let himself go. <laughs> mm -hmm. I noticed this. He, even though he's out of the race, he still has a $100,000 a plate dinner scheduled. Yeah, tomorrow at Denny's by himself. <laughs> now, see, that's a joke I don't make anymore. That's the old triumph. That is. The new journalist is. triumph. Well, well, what about Carly Fiorina? You I never, yeah, Car I never. Carly Fiorina's dropped out as well. I know, I bummed out because I never got to meet Carly face to face lift. <laughs> so far, everything you're talking about is Republicans. Are you, are you balanced in your criticism of people? Do you have anything to say about the Democrats? What about Sanders? Bernie, yeah, I don't get it. Bernie 2016, that's crazy. The man doesn't look a year over 2000. It doesn't seem like you're yeah. taking this job seriously. You seem like you, Are you, you kidding haven't me? done your research. Are you kidding me? I am not kidding Have you. Have I not done my research? Do you realize I went to Iowa, New Hampshire? I studied every candidate. I read every one of their books. Really? That they've every made. book? Every book. Wow. Would you like to see them? Yes, I would try. All right. Well, here, look, here's a book I read. I read Donald Trump. He's, his run's making history, and he's making history with this updated new book, Pride and Prejudice, Now with More Prejudice by Donald Trump. <laughs> Florida Governor Jeb Bush. He uh, still hopes he'll be the next uh, president of 1600 Penn. Read about his vision for the country in 
leading to courage. You're not going to show it. <laughs> His vision for the country, leading to courage, America freedom, future, ah, f*** it, I'm out. By Jeb Bush. I did my research. I did my research that no one say that I did not do my Prior research. Prior to election special 2016. <laughs>